Acts chapter 19 verse 23 says, About that time there arose a great disturbance about the way. A silversmith named Demetrius, who made silver shrines of Artemis, brought in no little business for the craftsmen. He called them together along with the workmen in related trades and said, Men, you know we receive a good income from this business. Now we're going to stop there because I want to share with you the first thing that tends to get in the way of us living the way. It gets in the way of us being disciples of Christ. And that first thing is money. We're introduced to a man by the name of Demetrius here who's a silversmith. Now Ephesus, what they were known as, as a port city. People would come in there and drop off goods or they would pick up goods. But while they were there, they were also there to introduce themselves to a goddess by the name of Artemis. You could also look at this from the Roman side and she would be known as Diana. She was a goddess who was there for fertility. These guys made these statues and so they lived off of people wanting or desiring to have something that they didn't have. Unfortunately for us, that is something that keeps us from living the way that Christ would have us live and that is that desire to have more, to have more, to seek more, to get more over and over and over. And it gets to a point to where we want and desire more and yet what we really want and desire more is to live in such a way that we can separate ourselves. That is why last week we talked about that sanctuary, so that we can set ourselves apart with God to talk to Him about those areas that we struggle in. Would you challenge yourself tonight to see what is it that may be in the way and see if maybe material things are getting in the way for you living in such a way that people can see a difference about you 